Welcome back, Earthlings. I uh, hope you're doing well. I certainly am. I think so, at least. I haven't been abducted yet by any weird aliens, so... But if you are watching, then, well, like and subscribe and all that from outer space. Whee! It's more Barca Boys today, and, uh, yeah, things have been a bit weird. We last saw each other in the cup final, uh, semi-final, sorry. Do you remember how I said, eh, I don't really want to be in the cup because, you know... Well, we're also out of the, like, the, the what, what's it even called? The normal Spanish cup. We lost to Leonesa, who are in Spanish second division B1. Is that, like, B? I don't know. Pro, there's all sorts of leagues down here. What a shambles. I mean, we did play, like, a lot of youngsters and still, but we still had, like, the young, well, no, that's the wrong one. Still had to deal with Alba, Elena, players like this, Depay, and we lost in uh, penalties, so that was fun. Before that, we got wrecked again by Athletic Madrid. Madrid, bit of Danish going on there. Um, yeah, they just kind of destroyed us. They're too good. But in the league, then we at least bounced back with wins over San Sebastian or Real Sociedad, as we call them. <coughs> Oh my god, as I'm dying. Sorry. And Granada, Getafe, and then recently Villarreal, that was just smashed 7-1. Mbappe scoring four goals and getting assist. He's uh, really turning it on nowadays, so... Both well. So today it's Zaragoza, which is how you pronounce it if you are proper Spanish. Not that I'm Spanish, but I did take like three months of Spanish in school. So I must be an expert, right? Because I am a knobhead, I just accidentally I skipped everything. So here's the starting lineup for today. We have Altai playing because Testegen is a little bit injured. So at the back, though, we have Des Tudibo, Garcia, and Alba. Uh, in front of it, we have Camavinga, Moriba, Trincao, Messi, Fati, and then Depay up front. Basically, I'm rotating a little bit uh, just before the all important Liverpool match. And yeah. I just want Mbappe not to die, please, because if he scores four goals against Liverpool, I'd be very happy. Oh, I just realized they have a, oh, a weird Icelandic geezer up front. I can get behind that. Valgeis, Valgeirson, son of Valgeir. What on earth happened in there? Well, Kamavinga has somehow scored. It the, the bit messy. The Prophet Muhammad in there was apparently involved. Let's see what actually occurs here. Garcia, then it's a... Yeah, yeah, I have no idea. Muhammad kicks it into Camavinga, I think. Then it just bounces into the goal. Oh, well. Not the prettiest of goals, but we'll take it. Oh, and they have royally cocked it up there as well in the defense. But we decide to go backwards. Okay, okay, okay. We are Barcelona. We like Tiki Taka. All that. Elba. Oh no. Not Fatty. Fatty the Fatty. Mariba, who's been. Ooh, into Messi. Good goal. Yeah, I was going to say Mariba has really been active so far in the first. It's only been 15 minutes, but we've seen a lot from him, so that's good. Yeah. <coughs> Just a nice little cross from Mariba. Pricks it in there to Messi and then go. Yeah, I think Moriba is one of the few ones that are. Oh, they've scored. Gaika Lala Sabal. Definitely, definitely pr correct uh, Spanish pronunciation there. <coughs> well, that was a bit poor. Vallejo with the corner and. Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Garcia. <sighs> he was like eyeing the ball, but then he didn't actually go for the ball. So. But I was going to say that Moriba is probably the one that's suffering a little bit. There's just not room to play him like every single game. But I try and give him as much game time as possible. But when you have De Jong and then Camavinga, it's difficult. Ooh, Garcia almost redeemed himself after the calamity at the back. Jordi Alba with the ball into Messi, who's dictating from the number 10 role. Camavinga to Alba again. Patient. I was going to say patient ball here, but no. We then go deep, and then Alba's going to cross it. Is he? Is he? Is he? Chica! Oh! Close. 
And yeah, as you can see over here, we are, well, right now we're eight points for, uh, ahead, so potentially five if they win their match. Athletic. Oh, Mariba! <gasps> nice chance. He almost deserves a goal. He's been playing really, really well. He has the assist, 7.4. Players are starting to get a bit knackered. This is definitely where we're going to do some changes. Yes. And let's see. I, I give Depay the chance, and he just plays, like, shockingly. Like, what's the point of that? You nubbed. So, we're going to get Lucian for him instead, and then we're going to do Petri for Chinkao and move Messi out to his normal right side. Who else? Should we give... We'll give Camavinga. Yeah. Give Pjanic on for Camavinga. We don't want to get him a, give him a red card. Uh, it's still 2-1. Definitely not over yet. I'd like to seal it with one more goal if puffs. Moriba again. Look, he's just involved in everything this day. This game. You gotta love it. I likes it. <laughs> Dest, who's playing today because I figured maybe we need defending. Oh, that was a strange what's it takedown, but oh well. Oh loud. Oh, do some proper tiki taka there. And Lutzi with a great goal. Second goal of the season for him. Well done, lad. I think he's only <coughs> as my voice is dying again. Test to Pjanic. I mean, this is some lovely football. First touch, Pjanic, Moriba, Messi, everyone's just getting involved. And then Luzzi with a great, great finish. Nice goal. I was going to say, I think he's... Is he 17? If I remember? Yeah, 17. So, good hope for the future. Well, 3-1. Don't need any more excitement now. Let's just finish the game. No one die. No one get injured. Mm -hmm. That was... Uh, Press press office is uh, messaging me saying they really need you for an in interview. I guess I will scurry out there and talk to them, and then we'll be back for some Liverpool action. Whew. The time has come, my friend. Are you gonna cock it up for us again, like you did in real life? Somehow, that's the only reason I bought you is so we can beat them damn scousers. Bloody be good this time. It is steed. Liverpool time. Don't make me regret putting you on, Trent. <clears throat> I know you don't defend. But you're bloody well going to have to in this game. Because I'm sure that Liverpool are still great. Also, it is still Klopp. So, we all know that our 3-0 is not going to cut it. But the team looks like this. To Stegen is back. So, he gets the start. And then Trent to Diego Garcia Mendes. Camavinga and Moriba because the young is randomly suspended. Oh well, it's a good thing Moriba was amazing last game, so I'm not really too worried about that. Chinkao, Messi, Fatsy, and then Mbappe up front. Or should I play Depay? No, he's crap. And Mbappe is in hot scoring form, so let's hope that uh, he continues it tonight. Oof, so much motivation I just did there. Amazing. Will you look to attack? Sure, I don't know. Are we gonna physically attack them or? I mean, if we can injure a few of their players. Uh, what, 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 what? Okay. That was a strange way to start a highlight, but um, okay. Corner from Salah, and then I have no idea what happened there. Let's just pause it and take a look at their team. So it's pretty standard. I mean, of course, they have now. Roberto as a right back instead of Trent, so... Hello, friend. It's been a while. And then... Matip, Van Dijk, Robertson, Fabinho, Henderson, Kate, Sosala, Mane, Firmino... Did we play a season, or...? I don't know. Isn't it the same? I mean... Did they buy any players? At this point, I need to know. What else have they done? Do they have any exciting ones? Okay, the bench is littered with all sorts. They have Gabriel Barbosa. Rafael Guerrero, who is great for well, getting there. <coughs> Anything else? Nothing too exciting, I would say. Well, they did make some signings, but apparently only for the bench. Which I guess is what they're doing in real life, too. When you have such a good squad, you just need some players to come in when half your squad dies from injuries. Which 
is what uh, is happening right now in real life, isn't it? For those of you who don't know, like right now is, uh, what is it? It's 3rd of February, 21, just saying. And uh, there, so the transfer window just ended, like was it yesterday or something in real life? And apparently Liverpool were pretty desperate buying some defenders. Yeah, oh well, who can blame them when half their team is injured? But oh yeah, yeah, I mean we do have a game here as well. I think so. But I just noticed, why am I playing in my away kits? I'm at home. It's a scam right there. If we lose this match, it's definitely because of that. We're not used to these black ones. I mean, that sounded a lot more wrong than it should. But you know I'm talking about the kits. Fatty, that was a great... Oh, is he, he's free, he's free. That was a great tackle from... Roberto, what are you doing? Stop ruining my fun. Uh, fatty. Uh, Messi with the corner right before half time. Oh, Turibo of all the people. First goal of the season. Well done, my friend. Matip Mati will take the blame. Look at Matip. He's huge. I mean, that's probably why he will take the blame. Let's see it again. So Turibo he just raises his highest. And, uh, yeah, Matip wasn't following him at all. Well, I'm not complaining. So that was half time then? <laughs> I mean,. Yikes, that was a boring half, but oh well. I'm actually going to say I'm not happy. We need more. Oh, snap, that was the wrong one. I should have encouraged them more. Let's hope I didn't ruin everything there. On a positive note, Trent hasn't cost me a goal yet, so that's good. Trent is on the yellow, though. Is he going to... Oh, that was a great... Mbappé! And he never misses from there. That's why you spend eight trillion euros for Mbappe or however many it is. He just scores goals. And Trent was kind of involved. Was that Matip again? Oh, it's Virgil. The worst defender in the history of the world. Or something, I don't know. Can't remember his title. Something like that. Something with defender at least. No, he wasn't very good right there. And they took him out? No, wait, they didn't. They just swapped around all sorts. Well, let's keep a clean sheet now, because away goals are scary. <coughs> Trincao is on the attack. Attack, 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 attack. Trincao on a great save from Becker. They must have bought a new keeper, because I distinctly remember Allison being in there usually, right? I don't know who Becker is. So weird seeing Becker. Who the heck calls him Becker? Ooh, I just noticed Fatty is like... His cholesterol is way up there. Look at that. He's so red. Huh? Poor guy. Hmm. The pie is always crap, so I'm gonna put Petri on up there. That is his natural position anyways, according to the game at least, so let's put him up there. Messi with a corner. Tribo almost did it. Oh, again. And Becker with the Oh no. That is uh pretty scary. Wijnaldum? Yeah, just shoot from there, mate. Shoot! Is this on a yellow as well, Milner? Ooh, ooh, are we gonna counter from it instead? Messi to Mbappe to Trincao. Oh, he has a lot to do from here himself. Yeah, that was poor, but at least we weren't countered on the counter, on the counter, on the counter, on the kitchen counter or something. Anyways, my players are proper knacker. Trincao is about to die as well. So I'm going to have to do all sorts here. Sadly, that means... Oh my god. That means that Depay is going to get some playing time. Oh well, maybe he will surprise me. And then Pjanic on for Moriba, who is also dying. Well, 2-0, I mean, it looks good. I 2-0, I think, is better than 3-0. Because we all know what happens if we... Lead 3-0 to Liverpool. Maybe the 2-0 will like ca catch, them, catch them off guard and they don't know what to do about it. Well, there was definitely a free kick in there somewhere, but we continue play. I mean, that was shocking. We definitely would have preferred the free kick then. <clears throat> Roberto on the ball. Are you going to help a brother out? Come on, friend. Come on, friend. No, he's... Lays it off to Keita, who shoots Camavinga. 
I mean, not like that. Oh, that was a great pass. A great save as well. I think it went wide. But, you know, it's one for the cameras. So, and yeah, can respect that. Saliba with the clearance to Mbappe, who... Yeah, you're fast. Just do it. Do it, do it. He's very isolated, but oh, that was a shocking... Shocking uh, attempt as well. So, hmm. The game's not over yet, or... Is there another highlight? Oh! <gasps> Off the post! Are you... Holy moly! I definitely thought that would go in. Well, well done lads, good win indeed, and like I said, 2-0 is probably good versus Liverpool, because they might be confused and not know what to do. Very, very good. Let's see. Is anyone saying anything? Football at its finest today, such a good match. Well, I agree. What the heck is this name? g u i n t u k m i t t u k m i t I have no idea. <coughs> But these are some funky names, isn't it? Nima Lamo. Okay. Well, view stage actually. Let's see what else is going on here. Porto smashed Napoli, which is lovely. Uh, Tottenham beat PSG, and then we have Athletic versus uh, United. That's an interesting one as well. Ooh, Southwick Lille. So one of these two would be great to meet if we actually do go. Forward, but it's not over yet, and it's always scary going to Anfield, mostly because you'll get mugged, right? No, I don't know. I've never been there, but hmm? so far so good. Uh, gonna play the next ones, and then we are back for the second leg and an away match, a uh, home match versus Real Madrid, where we need revenge. I feel like. Hmm? Till next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, share with all your amazing friends and family and uh, all the aliens out there. So, till next time, toodles!